Hi, and welcome to testhyphenai.com. My name is Manuel Rodriguez, and today I would like to introduce you to some of the new growth features that I have added to the Amblyopia Visual Acuity application for iPad and Android tablets. When you start the application, you can see the main screen. To navigate between screens, you only have to press on each of the buttons at the button bar. First, you can configure the settings by pressing the second button at the bottom bar. Some of the text features are up to type, distances or contrast level. Once you have decided the text settings, it's time to manage your patient's database. By this screen you can control the visual acuity progress in a patient or you can collect data for your research. To create a patient, press a new button over the patient list. Insert name, surnames, and the born day by this order: day, month, and year. Then navigate to a refractions screen. Select a patient and add a new refraction by pressing on new refraction button at the right side. It could be able to save test result with or without compensation. To do this, you have to create the patient and the refraction before begin the test. At this point, you are ready to start the test. Come back to the main screen and press on the button that corresponds to the aid which is going to be evaluated. If you have not changed the default settings, it will start at 0.8 logmar notation. To continue until the end, you only have to press on the button that corresponds to the patient answer. For instance, if the patient answer is so, you have to press it the letters indeed his or her answer would be wrong. Once the test finished, you get the visual acuity result in logmar and other notations, but only logmar will be saved into the database. Here you can add this result to a patient by pressing on add button. Select the patient and save with or without refraction. If the exam has been done with patient compensation, Select the proper refraction that you had added before the start the test. Finally, you can see test results in patient's screen. Please pay attention in the last patient you have pressed who appears in a green row before to apply any other option such as delayed, create refraction or others. Thank you for your attention. If you have any other question, please contact me by mail or by the contact form at www.test-i.com